Okay class, today's lesson will be on inverting cube root and cubic functions. Please fill in the word blanks by copying the words on the board. What? Why the hell are we doing this? It looks way too complicated. For real. This shit looks way too difficult, and I don't want to do it. I agree with Chloe and Lysandra. Who the hell likes learning algebra in the first place? It's not like it'll be useful in the real world anyways, so what's the point? I agree with the other three. This shit is pointless. Don't worry, this stuff is not complicated at all. It's actually really simple, so do not worry. Bullshit. I call bullshit. You say that every single time, but we never understand half of the shit you say because we don't care. Or maybe it's because you guys never pay attention in class and then you try and cheat on your tests so that you guys can make it seem like you are paying attention. Hey. Shut the fuck up Nino. This ain't got anything to do with you, so mind your own business you nosy piece of shit. Hey! What gives you the right to speak to my boyfriend like that? He didn't do anything to you guys, so just leave him alone. Hey, no one asked for your opinion girl, so shut your mouth you fucking bitch, which a cringy ass lady black. Chloe, you can't be talking. You're the one over here acting like an entitled Karen just because you are part of a rich family. There are some people in here who want to pass. Exactly, so shut your mouths, all four of you. Why the fuck should we listen to you two, huh? You ain't our parents nor are you adults, so just stay out of our business. We won't bother you two if you don't bother us. All four of you, shut the fuck up. Elia and Nino hasn't done shit to you four, so stop attacking them for no reason. Chrissy, as much as I appreciate you trying to help me out, I would like you to please try and stay out of this. Let me take care of this situation, okay? Okay, my bad Mrs. Johnson. It's okay. Just please, try not to get involved. Now as for you Chloe, Lysandra, Jackson, and Damien, all four of you need to start behaving right now. Stop giving me disrespect, and stop bothering the other students. And Lysandra, we thought that putting you in a different class period might make things better, but no. You continue to not focus in class, and distract others. Shut the fuck up! Yeah! This has got nothing to do with you Mrs. Johnson. It has nothing to do with me. You all are causing a disturbance for the entire class, so don't give me that crack right now. Now, stop it. And pay attention. And you act like the childish husband of yours is any better. All he does is act like a baby any time he doesn't get what he wants. Do not bring my family into this. Yes, he may act childish, but it's really not his fault. Also, I would rather deal with a childish husband than deal with a bunch of routines. You know what? Fuck you Catherine. You're fucking delusional if you think that a 40 year old man who acts childish is better than how we act. Clearly you have no brain, yeah, and if you got a problem with the way we act, then you can go fuck yourself. You know what? Fuck this. I can't take this crap anymore, I am sick and tired of dealing with people like you four, especially you Lysandra. You know what, just get out, no. You know what? No. I will not go to the office. Instead I will do this. Come here bitch. Wait, what are you doing? <laughs> Ouch. What the hell, Lysandra? Why would you assault me with a spike bat? Oh, grow up, you big crybaby. All I did was hit you a few times. Calm down. Lysandra, I'm fucking insane. What gave you the idea to assault the teacher, huh? You must be messed up in the head or something if you think that is okay. You know what? I'm taking you to the office myself and don't you dare try to assault me or I'll have you in the hospital faster than you can say no. Now come on, let's go. Oh, and you three are coming along too. Come on, let's go, now. Wow. Great going, Lysandra. Don't worry, Mrs. Johnson. I will call an ambulance right now. Just hang on tight. So, what brings you guys to my office today? Well, these four people behind me were causing a disruption during class by refusing to do their work, disrespecting, swearing, and yelling at the teacher and others. And then to make matters worse, Lysandra decided it would be a good idea to assault Mrs. Johnson with a spike bat. A fucking spike bat. Now she has to go to the hospital. 
Oh my god, thank you for telling me this. You can go ahead and leave while I deal with these four. Wow, good job Lissandra. You are the reason why we are in this situation right now. Thanks a lot dumbass. My fault. You guys were a part of this too, so don't blame this shit on me. Yeah, but assaulting the teacher with a spike bat. Really? That's way too far, and because of your stupid actions, we are all here now, so thanks a lot. Okay, that's quite enough you four, Jackson, Damien, and Chloe, for causing disruptions in class, and being rude to the teacher and other students. You three are suspended for four weeks. And Lysandra, I cannot believe that you assaulted the teacher with the spike bat. What the fuck is wrong with you? I always knew you were bad, but not this bad. And because of this, Lysandra, you are expelled from the school. Now, get the fuck out of here right now, and I will be contacting your parents. Jackson, we can't believe you right now. How dare you insult the teacher and cause a disruption in class with your friends? You know better than to do that. However, we are glad you didn't join Lysandra in assaulting the teacher. But that's besides the point. You are grounded until you are no longer suspended. Go to your room right now. Damien, how fucking dare you along with your friends insult the teacher and other students? You know that's not okay. At least you didn't help assault the teacher. But anyways, you are grounded until you are no longer suspended. Go to your room right now. Chloe, I am so disappointed in you. How could you swear and be rude to the teacher and others? At least you didn't help Lissandra assault the teacher, but besides that, you were grounded until you were no longer suspended. Now, go to your room please. Lissandra, what the fuck? Are you actually insane? How dare you insult, swear, and yell at your teacher and other students? On top of it you assaulted your teacher. And a fucking spike, that is well. Lysandra, are you out of your fucking mind? Now she has to go to the hospital thanks to you. That's it, we are calling the cops on you. But for now, go to your room right fucking now, as you are grounded. Go, now. You're lucky we don't give you an ass whooping. Hey guys, thank you all for watching today's episode. But before the video ends, I need to make some announcements. One. I am gonna try to upload more often, because I noticed I haven't really been uploading much recently. 2. Part 3 of Natalie Gavin's drama should come out tomorrow. And 3. Part 2 of this series should come out Monday. Anyways, stay tuned and have a great rest of the day.